Hey everyone, uh, welcome to a new episode of the Movie Slinger starring Nuan and Dinul. Uh, I think after Dune, we were all uh, discussing, I think yeah. me and Nuan, we were discussing about what shall we do next yes. before the next Dune movie comes in and I, mm. I hope we can do an episode after. Yeah, <laughs> we, are p- we are planning to watch it next week. But uh, interestingly... Yeah. Um, we came across, I think, Nuan came across Anatomy of a Fall. I believe I... You, you had already watched it. Yeah, watched it. And I think I mentioned in one of my top 10 films of last yeah, year. Yeah, yeah. Um, which made me interested in <laughs> the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, luckily, it, it, it started coming to the theaters because when I watched it, I watched it through, uh, through I think, streaming. Right. And um, I thought, you know what? This deserves a theater run in here in Sri Lanka, yeah. but um, I think quite recently they started showing this in theaters around yeah, the country. It, yeah, it was actually nice. They brought, uh, you know, e- uh, probably after it got nominated for, for some yeah. awards. Uh, for in, yeah. in Oscars and all yeah. of that. It, it started gaining traction. So I yes. think during this time it started getting a lot of yeah. awards from different, yeah. different uh, places around the world and different film awards. Um I mean, uh, before we start, uh, this is actually a French film for mm-hmm. anyone who still hasn't watched it. Uh, this is directed by uh, a, d- a, fem- a French director called Justin Triet, a uh, French director. It stars Sandra Huller, uh, Swan, Our Lord. Uh, again, I can't really pronounce <laughs> these words because they're all in French. Uh, so, Nuan, wha- what do you think? What yeah, this is, this, is, this is a very kind of interesting film like uh, mm-hmm. uh i mean it's pretty much all dialogue mostly right yeah uh so there's like uh this guy dies mm-hmm. right uh and then uh, it's basically about a- and and his wife is in the house yeah wha- around the, the time it yeah. happens yeah. so the whole point of the thing is like to figure out whether she d- was responsible she did, did she do it or was it an accident so that's yeah. th- the whole premise of this thing. I mean, the film title literally is Anatomy yeah. of a Fall. Yeah. So, def- oh, so he <laughs> obviously falls and dies. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, um, yeah, it's a it's a it's a really cool uh, movie where it it has kind of you know kind of detective kind of segments where yeah. they're trying to figure out the evidence, trying to figure out uh, you know what happened, and then the other stuff is like a lot of courtroom scenes mm. where they they kind of present this evidence and the lawyers are arguing yeah. uh th- their their point and 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 then o- there's obviously a very complicated situation happening in their private lives of yeah. this this lady the, right? the marriage life yeah especially. so yeah. all the all the details of like uh, the problems in the marriage and everything starts coming out at first, it seems like okay, yeah. but then the more stuff get, comes out, yeah. the more <laughs> you realize how, how... It's very complicated yeah. and, and not easily black and white. Exactly. Um, and there's a kid involved as well. Yeah. The kid is blind, I think. Yes, the kid is blind, uh, actually. The blind, yeah. and so that kid also, like... Um, so he's also been questioned about... Because mm. he was also... I think he leaves the house yeah, with with, with, with his uh, dog. With his yeah, dog. Snoop. Uh, yeah. but but yeah. the kid is also being asked questions and so he's also like it's complicated because he obviously wants to do the right thing yeah but then he's worried that maybe he's worried that uh, information that he reveals might get his mother arrested or yeah. um, so it's very complicated in that sense as well yeah no yeah. and also i think um yeah, I, th- I think you mentioned everything that was mm. mentioned. Um, I mm. think um, I think one of my favorite scenes yeah. in this entire entire film. Were, I mean, I know we are skipping a lot of yeah, scenes, yeah, but yeah. Uh, there's a scene where there's this argument, right. a voice recording of an argument yeah. going on, played in court. Yes, and it's an argument between the wife and the husband, mm. where the wife argues, saying that you know you're not someone who's willing to take responsibility. Mm-hmm. You tend to sit on the sidelines, and then you yeah. blame it on me, and yeah, yeah. becomes this huge fight. Yes, yeah. uh, I think those that monologue was like the most. I yeah. think one of those memorable scenes in the film. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And especially the dog, the dog was an actor too. Yeah, the dog <laughs> was like amazing in this one scene where 
so there's some sleeping pills or some yeah. kind of thing involved and the dog is sort of poisoned with it yeah. and and it's doing like this thing where it's sort of like about to die about to die and, and it's suffocating and yeah then and it's doing this weird performance and i'm like how did they do that like <laughs> what did they do to the dog to get yeah. that right I, i i remember you asked me yeah, i thought is it like a puppet or something yeah like i was like no 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 this was all done by the dog right. i i found out um this dog right. is quite talented i think hey. i started now I, i think if you go on like tiktok and instagram and if you're into film you right. will find out this dog is now showing up everywhere in oh, this right. award ceremony right <laughs> they should, they I, should i think literally yeah. someone said there should be like an oscar category uh-huh. for like best, animals best dog <laughs> best boy <laughs> best boy category yeah <laughs> and um yeah I yeah so I, that, that scene was very scary because you're mm. like worried like uh, okay what's going to happen to the dog like yeah. it's like suddenly like <laughs> it got very real <laughs> <laughs> and and it looks real too yeah like you said it it it's the dog mm. it, who's doing i don't know how they trained it to do that but it's doing this thing and and it looks very scary uh yeah it's very alarming that scene uh yeah that and that scene and a lot of the courtroom scenes are also very very good like and and I like I really like the prosecutor lawyer <laughs> cuz he's uh, I I cuz there's a bit of humor like it's very dry but like yeah. it's sort of there I, I like his sense of sarcasm when yeah. he asks questions yes yes and um, there's one uh, so so there's a, a thing that uh, comes up is uh, so while the the husband's death occurs mm-hmm. there's a song playing Yes. which is sort of like a cover of 50 cents PIMP yeah. <laughs> and 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 uh it, it has so a more for reggae tone into yeah, it yeah it's like, like a it's like an instrumental version yeah. and 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 that prosecutor lawyer kind of points out that w- so was your husband trying to say something when he put on this song yeah and, and while like you were having an interview yeah and 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 then then it become like for a brief moment <laughs> it becomes about that song like what it means and, <laughs> and and kind of like and then somebody says oh no but it's an instrumental version it's version. not the actual ver- yeah. you know but i i found it very funny that uh, a 50 cent song became like a <laughs> at least a minor plot point but it is yeah. there throughout cuz yeah. cuz we hear it a lot uh, in the beginning Yeah when it's being played during that scene where he dies Yeah to to give yeah. a lot more co- con- yeah. spe- context because yeah. um, this film starts off with uh this woman having an inter- interview with a college student or a journalist about yeah, yeah. she's an author yeah. she's a best selling author yeah. and i think she's come to kind of interview her about her books and yes. her sort of inspirations and what not and the husband in the upstairs he's, he's like playing music yeah, and he's fixing the house or something yeah and and he apparently he plays music to kind of annoy the wife yeah right? kind of and 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 as the interview continues you the music the gets a bit yeah. loud and loud and so loud and then um, so pimp is basically <laughs> going on a loop or going on a loop uh, and yeah. um and then the i mean the wife gets pretty mm. annoyed by this and yeah. uh, tells the journalist let's have this on another day and yeah. uh, leaves yeah, yeah. Uh I think in the meantime also I think the sun also like goes out the for sun a while. Sun also walk. goes out. Uh and, and there's like another interesting part where cuz the sun is there and he hears something. Mm. Uh the husband and wife talking and then later on they have to verify what he heard or yeah uh how he whether his 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 version is true. Mm. And so they have to do this thing where they have to play the music again. Yeah. Later on the investigators they yeah. have played and try to figure out where was the kid when this and scene and they, happened they, they, they're asking him like can you hear what they're yeah, saying yeah can you hear yeah i think on the second floor there are two cops they are speaking yeah, to yeah, each other yeah. loudly to kind of mimic yeah. that uh, yeah. scene cuz the kid is blind and so yeah, yeah. there's an issue like was he really where yeah, he said and, he and, was and right and so i think when yeah. the kid comes back from the walk he realizes that I mean he can't see but he feels that yeah. something is in front of him and yeah, basically yeah. it's his father's body. Yes. Um I also I think uh also this kid wasn't uh, blind by blind because of some birth yeah, issue yeah, yeah. or something. Yeah. Uh that also later plays on in, yeah. later on we find out that this kid got into an accident and he lost yes. his sense of yes. sight. And I think that was sort of the beginning of where this whole uh fall out of relationship yeah. happens because it was yeah. i think the husband's he was supposed to watch 
the kid, right? Yeah, no, the I, I think was he it? was supposed to like I think pick the kid from school or some I right. I, I remember something on yeah. on like you so he, you mentioned. So yeah. he he feels a bit of guilt yeah. for that, right? I think. I I yeah, and also the yeah. wife also feels like not he, guilty. She, she's she she's angry. She puts the blame on, on him. On, yeah, on yeah, him. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And um so there there's also that scene where I think the lawyer asked whether you cheated on your husband and mm. she said I did it once I think after the accident because right. she yeah, yeah. couldn't deal with what yeah, yeah. happened afterwards and as a sort of escape from all of these problems she mm. slept with some other woman and uh, yeah. I, again this film I think really went down to like the nitty gritty yeah and even when I mentioned before it was literally what the title of this film yeah. is it was not only yeah. just the the, f- the physical fall, but like but like, like a, a yeah, yeah, yeah. whole other fallout fall. of the yeah. the whole marriage and all that. Also, I think uh, you may have noticed in the film um, they also ma- mention about her books. Yeah, there's a very interesting thing about the books. And uh, yeah. they ask whether these are these characters and bo- and the stories based off of your real life or mm-hmm. your marriage, and then the yeah. argument comes in that. Because the argument then uh, begins saying that uh, does uh, media depict, yeah. how, do I, how do you say it, like, does it cause violence mm-hmm. or do, is it an indirect consequence of such violence in real life? Mm-hmm. And then I think someone mentions William Shakespeare, or I, I can't <laughs> remember who the, what the, re- no, Stephen King. Stephen King. Oh, and yeah. They said that, that is Stephen King a murderer because <laughs> he writes horror stories. <laughs> 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 I was sitting <laughs> back then, I was yeah, laughing, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right? Uh, so I I think in many instances yeah. there's this kind of blurred line between mm. fantasy and reality. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think maybe because she's an author also. Yeah, and 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 a, a lot of uh, the stuff she writes about seems to have been inspired by her life like, mm. and, and like real issues like with the mm. parents or yeah. There are things that she has taken from real life and 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 that kind of comes into play. And then there's also the other thing where she may have stolen some ideas from the husband like yeah. for, from a book he didn't write yeah and so there's some animosity mm-hmm. coming from that as well yeah. but then he also has but then he also hasn't put in the work to to finish the book book yeah and so she says oh i just i used the idea but i didn't steal the whole thing, thing. Yeah. so there's this whole thing going on <laughs> like uh, you know yeah. uh, I, I guess life imitating art art imitating life and it's keeps going on in a circle mm-hmm. kind of a way almost also yeah. um, another thing i notice also is the usage of language mm, yes. is that when they're yes. speaking out in the public yeah. they use french but yeah. when they're speaking very in-depth issues and yeah. whatever they're feeling yeah this sort of th- in-depth feeling they speak in, the in english in right? the court they have to speak uh, french yeah but then but then the wife is like she's german so i think <laughs> she, she yeah. so she she's more comfortable speaking English I English think. Yeah. yeah and so and th- even that becomes part of the argument right mm-hmm. because the husband is sort of saying okay we are living in France but yeah you're making us talk speak in English like at home and because she and she yeah. has sort of imposed that on mm. the on the family right? yeah and 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 he's upset that you're making the kid also you're forcing kinda, the kid yeah, to yeah, like yeah. Uh, so there's speak, like a yeah. lot of stuff like that and y- she switches, right? Like yeah. a lot of the time, like you can tell, like she, she kind of man. I I felt like she was manipulating also because right. she was like, okay, but you forced us to come to. I think it was Iceland they were living in. I I can't uh, remember the country they were the, the uh, they were living before. No, no, not not before. They so the place where the incident happened. It's in France, right? Is it in France? I, I, I think can't so. remember. I think so it's in France. So yeah. this that's she his hometown. Yeah, hometown. Yeah, so yeah. she tells that, oh, but but we are living fo- here. Yeah, yeah, we are living here in your hometown because yeah, you wanted yeah, to. And yeah. That's where I think uh, yeah, yeah. the the wheels start turning yeah, in that yeah. whole uh, mm. argument. Um, and there's a lot of stuff <laughs> like that. Like there's so much, so much dirt that gets kicked up. <laughs> as the more you go into this, yeah. right? The also, yeah. I think they brought in the uh, the husband psychologist. Where right. Yeah. 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 Uh, there are some 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 pills involved. And that yeah. that is also connected to the dog. The dog yeah. is also uh, 
that's what because, the dog uh, is ODing they, they on they asked the yeah. what how how was the husband mm. feeling about the marriage and uh, the psychology the i think the psychiatric psych check i mean maybe psychiatrist. the psychiatrist or maybe the counselor yeah. i can't remember exactly but he's the guy who gives the prescription yeah, for prescription. the prescription uh, yeah. he says that uh, her husband was suffering a lot with the relationship mm-hmm. he was depressed because yeah. of the accident and uh, while that's going on the wife objects to it and she's like who are you t- you're just a shrink <laughs> and and that also becomes another argument yeah and uh, i i think as as a viewer i felt like we were kind of the detectives of the story yeah, yeah. So we yeah. we don't actually see what happens in what actually ca- happened. Yeah, yeah. We, we see we hear what they say. Mm-hmm. Like uh, and then there's a part with the pills where she thinks he may have tried to commit suicide at one point. Mm, yeah. And so that's I think that's the argument the defense is going to make because they they mm-hmm. they are saying they're trying to say that he may have committed suicide that's how he died. Uh, yeah. So to to get the wife out of the mm. thing, right? So and also i think afterwards that's where the i because the son is also in the court mm, listening mm. to all of this yeah yeah and i think at even and it's affecting him you can see yeah, how you can it's see how mentally yeah. he's being affected and yeah. i think because uh, since you mentioned the husband trying to commit suicide yeah. using the pills, but we don't he, know that for we, sure we don't know that yeah. so he tests it out, out with his dog yeah yeah the kid wants to know what really happened what right? really happened yeah, yeah. uh because yeah. he remembers something about uh because he remembers the dog getting sick after he thinks the dog ate one what, of the what pills the, what the, yeah. the what the husband uh, threw up yeah he vomited yeah he licked uh, it and then he was a fe- possible yeah. suicide attempt yeah and then the dog got sick mm-hmm. and so he wanted to see if the same thing happens again again uh, <laughs> it was really it was kind of messed up <laughs> in a way <laughs> but I, i mean yeah but he also wants to know how whether what happened with these yeah. parents right so mm. because I, i either his dad committed suicide <laughs> or the mother killed him mm. which are equally both messed up yeah right and 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 we are never really sure like we are never really sure which uh, and and the, the the whole thing plays out like you know the evidence is presented the arguments are made and 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 there's a jury i think right yes, there's a there's jury, a jury right? also yeah and there's all that happening so and we only get what they find out basically we don't we don't get we a flashback scene that we shows never get it, yeah. what happened yeah uh, well, there's I, no I, I, yeah. i think there was only one flashback scene in the recording yeah when they play they, the they, recording they wanted to kind yeah. of give us the context of yeah, like yeah. what was actually happening yeah, and yeah. i also like the way they use the sound also to yeah. feel like you're actually listening yeah, to a yeah. recording yeah. too yes 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 because it, it that's where mm. again the blurred lines also play yeah. in because towards the end of the recording you You, f- you, you can't. You don't grain. know, and yeah. it and it cuts back to the courtroom. Yeah. So we don't Very actually smoothly. see. Very yeah. smoothly. Yeah. Yeah. So we only hear the we, when we see the flashback, we see the parts that are very clearly. Mm. You can tell he's saying this and she's saying that. Yeah. But when it becomes sort of like a fight, yeah. it cuts back to the courtroom, courtroom and, and we don't yeah. know who's hitting who, like what's yeah, going exactly. on. Exactly. Yeah. And 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 even like the expert they bring in, mm. they have to kind of interpret what. what may have happened yeah. which is true like mean, that's realistic I, I, we I don't know i think even at at one point so um i think after the crime after the crime scene they they take the body to the morgue right yeah and then they investigate the body and they investigate yeah. the wife's hand also ah uh, yeah and then that's There's why some i think that that yeah, whole yeah. fight uh, thing yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. begins yeah cuz she says yeah. that she hit it on the on the table or yeah. something but then <laughs> it comes back to the 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 yeah. the fight also uh, i i think uh, i think it, it's sort of i think our first time seeing a courtroom outside from an in, a, in another country how it mm. works i mean yeah. structurally yeah, i mean yeah, physically yeah. the way it's been set out yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. the way how they present each other cuz yeah usually i mean when you watch a lot of hollywood films yeah. you know the court is set up in in such yeah, a manner yeah, and yeah. This was like totally alien to us. Mm-hmm. I think that's where I mm-hmm. think that whole suspense also brings in because you don't know who's going to show up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it, it, it was a very like I mean, you're kind of hanging on to every moment and every every word because you're because like because as the viewer yeah. when you're going through this film you're like okay the wife is guilty. Yeah. Because the way things are being brought yeah. up, the fight. There's the, too many things. Yeah. But there's also like 
you know there's no clear evidence as well like that yeah yeah and 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 i like how when it ends it doesn't it like i said before it doesn't show what happened <laughs> it just you just know what the final verdict is yeah which is very uh, is what happens in a real situation Life right situation uh, you, you never know what you really happened right? yeah you never really you never get to see what happened you just <laughs> know the verdict yeah. based on whatever the evidence and all of that is and presented and then people move yeah. on people move on and yeah. and, and you still like left with the question like what did what, she still do did happened? she do yeah. it or what yeah. like, like what really yeah. happened that yeah, day, yeah, yeah. you know uh, yeah. also i i mean some of you all may be wondering like um, this anatomy of fall how mm. it happened and yeah. why the wife is being brought brought to court because right. what the police mention is if he fell off from the second floor right. it's an accident but this guy fell off from the third floor right right which right. can indicate it's a murder also cuz mm-hmm. the the i think the shed yeah they they, they below, check yeah. Uh, i mean and they they throw down like a dummy to yeah. see how it falls and stuff yeah. right but yeah. even that like there are multiple versions of how it how could it have happened could have happened yeah. yeah yeah because the yeah. the wife brings an ex- for a forensic expert yeah, yeah, and yeah. she says no this is an accident because of the way the blood has been split yeah, over yeah, yeah. and then an- and the prosecutor brings in another expert yeah, saying yeah. no because the way he fell on the sled mm-hmm. so it's like you don't know who's telling the actual yeah, truth yeah, yeah, yeah. and there is no flashbacks like yeah, in yeah. usual in in these yeah, kind yeah. of movies i mean towards yeah. the end of the movie you'd expect a flashback or maybe the character would yeah. say yeah i did everything <laughs> and this is how i uh, yeah. you know but i like this ending yeah, 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 to yeah. be honest because it felt really realistic yeah, yeah, yeah. um it felt right for this kind of film mm, yeah, yeah because i was also thinking maybe when we go through the credits maybe they would really say something like <laughs> after this many years later they she writes <laughs> in a book or something i was like waiting and then the credits so i was like well, ah, well okay. that would be kind of uh it did remind me remember uh, there, there was a case i think a real situation where somebody killed their partner mm-hmm. and then they wrote a book about how to get away with it or something oh i, okay. I remember it was on like facebook i don't know if it's like a meme or a real thing or yeah. what yeah but somebody <laughs> did um you know i, I know they did like so their partner went missing mm-hmm. and then sometime later they they wrote a book about how to get away with this wow. sort of thing and <laughs> and uh, I, i i i remember like that that was like uh, something that was being shared on facebook and stuff <laughs> so I, th- it reminded me of this because she yeah. was also using her real life stuff to write books right yeah so it would kind of make sense that years sometime later she would put out a book about you know uh mm. how yeah. somebody gets away with a murder mm. or something <laughs> that would have been that would have yeah. been actually it would have been sort of in a way in line yeah. i would say how we, i would expect yeah, yeah, yeah that yeah. that would not be no, too because weird. the ending was very like i yeah. won't say abrupt it was like very casual she just goes home and the kid uh, is and, there and, and also yeah. before that they go yeah. for dinner they celebrate yeah. it like yeah, it yeah, was yeah. nothing but yeah, yeah. i think at one moment when they were having the celebration mm. and when everyone is going out for yeah. drinks i think it's a lawyer and the wife yeah, yeah, yeah. and i think they kind of had some sort of a fair or they something they had something like, like a long time ago or yeah. something right yeah yeah and, then, and even uh, he is not like when she asks him do you think i did it like yeah he we don't know what he thinks he really thinks, right yeah he doesn't get, he, give a cur- he, like yeah, a yeah. straight yeah. straight i mean he's, answer, he's, yeah. he's helping her yeah. uh, win the case but we don't know whether he actually believes she did I, it and i remember at, at that point she she says mm. that um uh i know i have won the case but it doesn't but feel like a yeah like, like a victory because yeah, yeah. like she lost her husband yeah and yeah yeah i mean she she can't really go back to her son yeah. and in like the same way i mm. think this court case like change, changes everyone's everyone. yeah, life yeah, yeah. so yeah. yeah i mean she's not going to prison but it's not yeah it's it's not a real victory and and also yeah. there is also i think i think we we missed this part um, yeah. the husband also had a lot of debt to oh right okay there was some financial that's issues, why they had yeah. to move out and right, that's right, why right, they right, had right. all of that so I think uh, even I think after the case they said that you had to settle the they they had to go to the bank to settle some uh, debt okay. I can't remember because okay, okay. they couldn't I pay up the lawyer or something Right okay I I I I I almost missed that mm. But uh yeah it's very very interesting <laughs> film and and I'm glad to have watched it it was yeah. it was 
and it's nominated for some awards, right? Yeah, I think the actress nom- uh, yeah. San- Sandra Hiller. Yeah, she was nominated. I think the film also nominated. It got nominated for best, I think, foreign right. motion picture. Oh, it's it's not best picture. It's no, it, it's, it's not best it's foreign. Yeah, I think in the foreign inter like kind right. of the international uh, category. Right, 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 right. Um, I mean. It sucks that because this film, <laughs> I think, got released last year, I think, around um, September, October. Right. And uh, I watched this film around November because I, I heard, sa- I, I, cause, I mean, you go through Facebook and you mm. go through social media and then you come across these people and they're mm. like, you should watch this. Like, people aren't yeah. talking enough about yeah, it. Yeah. And I think now I think it's getting popular. Now it's getting attention. Because yeah. after that, after yeah. all the Oscar nomination, yeah. like the announcements and all, and it's now they're kind of like going on. I this mean, it, it, they even brought it here. So yeah, uh, yeah. So, so it's good, like, I guess. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. happy that I yeah. mean, I'm happy that you go, got yeah, to like yeah, go yeah. to theater and yeah, actually yeah. experience it like for the first mm. time. Um, I unfortunately watched it on laptop, <laughs> but, <laughs> but still, yeah, uh, I mean, it was a good yeah, film. It was a good film. Yeah. Good, good experience. Um, I think after watching this film, I also started watching a lot more French movies. Oh, right. Okay. Because uh, I think um, the the thing, if you're into French movies, usually you have to be like a film buff. You have <laughs> to, you know. But this film, right. it didn't feel like a French movie. Yeah. Okay. I, I think because English was also used... Mm. I I know this film is a bit slow. It's not a it's not an artsy film. Yeah, it's not a very artsy. It's a very film. it's yeah. a very kind of hard hitting drama kind drama, of drama. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> yeah. So it, it's not it's not difficult to sit there and watch. Yeah, it's very it's very interesting in uh, like moment to moment. Because most French movies, they I mean the stereotype is they yeah. are very long. Yeah. And it takes a long time for you yeah. to like digest like what's going on. Yeah, I, g- I guess. Uh, it, it's a it's a very hard that's watch. What, that's what people. I, I yeah. guess when they have that artsy <laughs> kind of thing <laughs> that is kind, you know, yeah, uh, but difficult uh, to approach. But for anyone out there mm. who's interested, uh, I mean, this is a good film yeah. to watch. Yeah, like yeah. This is kind of those films you watch it once, and you a- enjoy that yeah. experience. You don't have to watch it again because yeah. you'll remember something out of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Especially that you know that that voice recording monologue. Mm, 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 mm. That was like the best. I mean, yeah. Uh, I remember she says that you have so much pride that it goes <laughs> to your head. And she goes on and on and on. I was like, wow. Yeah. <laughs> That's a. Uh, yeah. She. Do you think she'll win Best Actress? Uh, Does she so have the chance? Sh- I, I think she is in another film called Zone of Interest. Oh wait, she's in that as well. Yes. And I which I is also nominated, right? Which is also nominated. Uh, Sandra wow. Bola, yeah. Yes, Zone of Interest. She's oh, okay. also in that film. Wow, so she's in two films that she's are... She's in two films that, uh, that have gotten nominated. Um, uh, this one, though, The Zone of Interest, it's about the Oshkowish... Oshkowish... The, the, the concentration camp. Yeah, and the stuff. concentration right. camp. I think she plays the mother also in right, this. Right, right. Because uh, mm. their their family home is mm. right next to that concentration. Oh right, and okay. there's just a wall between. Them. Right, right, right. And, and right. I think it's all about them discovering. Discovering what's, what's happening. What's actually inside. going on? And mm. uh, yeah. But then, 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 okay, <coughs> she could win. But then, best actress, I think, is between Lily Gladstone and yeah. Emma Stone. I think I what I people I are I saying. I think Lily would win this time. I have a feeling she will. Yeah. I mean, that that yeah. I I, I, I haven't watched poor things yeah. yet. But people are saying Emma Stone is very good. Good, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's gonna be wow! Like so, Oscars are go- is gonna be like next month, I think, right? Oh yeah, uh, it is right next so month. Uh, yeah, it'll yeah. be interesting to see uh, how how everything turns out. <laughs> uh, whether you know who's it, who's it? I mean, I think Oppenheimer is yeah is locked in for best picture and best director. <laughs> I think yeah, Mr. Uh, Nolan pretty much. It. Yeah, I, I think he's got it. <laughs> uh, the interesting ones are actually like best actor because mm. it's gonna be Giamatti versus Killian Murphy. Yeah. Is, uh, Paul G- Paul Giamatti is like, I feel like this has been a long time coming. Yeah, I f- I feel like he should. I, I think I he deserves I it. I, I think I know I know he deserves it, but yeah. I know Killian Murphy is gonna get yeah, it anyway because <laughs> like the guy has been. Go- I yeah, mean, yeah, I yeah. mean, look, yeah, all yeah. these guys they've been going on a tour, yeah. right? Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. And I've noticed a lot of lot of the movies are getting who are winning these awards is mostly yeah. Oppenheimer. Oppenheimer is getting a lot yeah, of the getting a lot. Yeah, so yeah. I I think obviously yeah. Oscars are gonna be like because you know yeah. I think 
I think Nolan hasn't won in, like he's been nominated for a long time but he has not won. won so yeah. I feel like this year it's <laughs> going to sweep the whole thing right <laughs> that that's the that's what it looks like. Yeah yeah. Uh so we we'll have think, to see. I mean be- I think I I think best director might go to Nolan. It's probably yeah. I think that that's pretty much pretty a obvious. Set. I think that's uh, set. That's I think uh, wait best is, is Oppenheimer in best original screenplay no right? Uh, it's adapted screenplay. Adapted, right? Yeah, I think he might win that too. Right. Maybe, maybe. The weird one is Killers of the Flower Moon not nominated for best adapted screenplay. <laughs> I don't get that because it's they, supposed they, to be they, a really good book they, as well. They, they weren't in the entry. They were not. N- I don't think they were nominated for best adapted screenplay. I think it wow. missed out, which is weird. Like maybe. May, wait. So wait. Who was the studio that did color? It was Apple, right? It was Apple. No, but Killers of the Flower Moon is nominated for Best Picture. Okay, okay. But I, not I, I, screenplay. I, I, I get it's it. It's not getting it, for I get screenplay. It, I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Which is like... No, I, I, I mean like... Because, I mean, end of the day, all these film studios, they, they are pumping yeah. money to get That's these... That's They are going yeah. for these campaigns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I felt like they were like thinking either we go for Best Picture. Mm. I, I think as a be- Best Picture has a bit more, I think, of a... True, Sense true, of true. premium, I guess. Well, it is the big thing right? yeah it's, it's, it's a, a big final one, final yeah yeah, yeah, yeah yeah so i think they they didn't want to go for adapted screenplay right. they want to get the best <laughs> picture and then you know i mean if they actually win it they yeah, might yeah. who knows they might even yeah, yeah. bring it to blu-ray and yeah yeah yeah, yeah. maybe bring it to vision pro <laughs> 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 you could watch uh, killers watch of the flower moon <laughs> yeah apparently avatar looks amazing it seems uh, oh, wow. james cameron's uh, oh, yeah, on the on Vision, the Vision Pro. Pro, people have been watching uh, <laughs> and 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 say like, "Wow, it's pretty, wow. pretty incredible." <laughs> you know, th- okay, <laughs> I know we are going totally yeah. off of yeah. out of topic, yeah. but we we have to, I think, bring this in discussion. Mm. Um, I think, I think, I, I think uh, the both Avatar movies mm. are more like experiences. Yeah, and I think it makes sense that if they yeah. if we can watch it on a Vision Pro. Yeah, it'll look it's incru- not, incredible. It's, yeah. not, it's yeah. not a film yeah. film per yeah. se, but it's more like you know. I mean, that's yeah. what he was trying to do with do it as with well, it, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Even though the story is very like you know. <laughs> 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 yeah. True. 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 Well, it'll be it'll be interesting to see in a few weeks. We'll we'll know what we'll get what's to know. gonna win yeah, and and, yeah. and and But I, you know, I I guess you know we were upset earlier when Dune got uh, delayed. Yes. Uh, but I think it's pro- maybe it's a good thing because it's not competing with Oppenheimer at yeah. the Oscars. Like, because yeah. a lot of people are saying Dune Part Two is incredible. Mm. The reviews have all been like really. No, uh, and and also I think. I think we spoke about even Mission mm. Impossible yeah. released during the whole Barbenheimer yeah, 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 yeah. season. I think they so also kind of suffered yeah. a bit. Yeah. True, even true. though like Tom Cruise is a supporter of those two yeah, movies. Yeah, he supported <laughs> everything. <laughs> and nobody no, supported him. Nobody <laughs> supported him. <laughs> no, but um, uh, I, I, I think that yeah. um, it was good. Dune and good. Dune opening yeah. now has no pretty much no competition no, for no a while. No competition, so exactly. So yeah. Because it, after yeah. Dune, it's Kung Fu Panda 4. Yeah. And that's it. <laughs> that's like a completely <laughs> different movie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna find out next week what yeah. what what we're we're we going for an early access. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Premiere. We couldn't wait till the real <laughs> <laughs> the real release date. So yeah, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. We thought okay, let's go and so yeah. yeah I mean, uh, I mean next week after uh, after watching Dune Part Two, mm. I think we'll do a review. We'll do a review. I, I have a feeling that it there could be. It mm. could be like the David Lynch movie <laughs> because, like, I I see now they're having the fight scene in right. the second part. So yeah. you know, it's basically the last forty minutes of Probably. the David Lynch film <laughs> where they rush everything, <laughs> exposition. Yeah. Uh, let's hope uh, Denny will know doesn't uh, doesn't ruin <laughs> it. Doesn't, so doesn't yeah. stumble at the <laughs> end. Uh, yeah, because he no, because uh, mm. before all of this, he said he wants to do Messiah. Yeah, he's he's so planning to do Messiah. Yeah. yeah, so I think he might he might yeah. crush and, it. And and I'm hoping thing. this will be a big hit, mm-hmm. so we do get Messiah at yeah. one point. And also this yeah. time it's not uh, it's not released on a streaming service. Yeah. At the same time. Yes. So yes. that's good. Yeah. They yeah, kind of yeah. suffered. Also they suffered a bit yeah. from the last time. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It was <laughs> Warner Brothers, man. What, get your get your shit together. <laughs> 
so anyways mm. thank you so much for tuning in yes. uh please stay tuned for the next episode and also upcoming episodes uh we you can follow us on facebook uh you can listen us through spotify google podcast which is going to be closed on <laughs> april and also on apple apple podcast yeah. so yeah please stay tuned and see you guys soon see you guys bye bye